and welcome Destiny Christian Church. It's been a while. I took a bit of a break for the summer because I do so many podcasts that sometimes you get what's called podcast burnout. And uh, just a, a quick note, these next podcasts I'll be doing are going to be more like a thought for the day or just a verse for the day. And then I'll be kind of um, just, you know, just bouncing things off of you, things you can think about or pray about. And I was thinking about Abraham's four altars that he sacrificed at during his lifetime. And I'm sure there were more, but there were four in the scriptures that, that are recorded that speak of different phases of his journey or different times of closure or different or new seasons or, or, or times of surrender. And uh, in order to let go, right, we, we must, in order to go, rather, we must let go first. And many of those altars were about letting go. And Abraham built altars on four separate occasions in the scriptures. And as F.B. Meyer once said, each step of real advance in the divine life will involve an altar on which some dear fragment of the self-life has been offered. And he goes on to, to talk about, you know, beneath which some cherished idol has been buried. <laughs> and, you know, so dramatic, right? But it's true. And we find that, that in, in our lives, sometimes we, um, we, we hold on to things and those things keep us from obeying God. And anyone can attend church, right? Anyone can say, I'm a worshiper, I love Jesus, but what's on your altar? If I, if I gave this a title today, I'd call it, what's on your altar? Is there something on your altar that belongs to God that was maybe once yours and not surrendered? And hence, uh, Leonard Ravenhill said that a Christianity that costs nothing does nothing. So I want to leave that thought with you today as short as it is, but it's a thought nevertheless that maybe there's something in your life or my life that is keeping us, hindering us from growing because we haven't put something on God's altar. So uh, I want you to be encouraged today. And as, as we um, continue to uh, do these little podcasts, if you have any thoughts or suggestions or things you want to hear about, let me know because they are fun to do. And uh, once I do my other pod podcasts, I just do these as well and, and just get them done. So take care, guys, and keep checking the website out for changes and for uh, different things that we're doing. And check out the Facebook and the YouTube channel. And so until next time, God bless you.